So how we doing guys? Welcome, it's Kraken here. Get ourselves some food. I spent the night time mining away and started thinking that I would start boxing some of this in and rebuilding a new roof onto here because we kind of knocked half of the sides of this wall out and um, I haven't done anything else with it so I thought we'd do that. Anyway, that's not how we do the intro so... Welcome, it's the experiment season and we're back on day number 19. I did get a silver nugget overnight, which was very, very nice. Um, the mining, so what did we get? We've got a ridiculous amount of iron. I was using loads of coffee. So we've got 6,000 spare down here and 6,000 in the forge. So loads of cement coming as well. That's good. We have got to do another run to the desert at some time and we have got a ridiculous amount of cement so all things are looking good i harvested our little garden here as well which is all good today how's our game stage looking i know we've got a few points as well to spend 67 so we're getting up there in the game stage if we look at the map yesterday i came and checked this out and we've got a working stiff tools over here and we've got a shamway store we need a crucible. We have we have no way of making steel yet. So we need a crucible. So I think we should head over head over here on our on our motorbike and go and check out this brand new working stiff stool. Because we haven't um we haven't checked any of those out yet. So let's get cracking. Right, here we go then. The working stiff stool. Let's get ourselves another repair kit quickly because our axe is about to die so let's get that repaired all our tools are looking lovely jubbly in fact we'll stick that silver nugget in there as well beautiful right we've only got one lock pick refusing to buy any more lock or make any more lock picks let's quickly just Grab some of this stuff on the outside, see what we've got here. Ooh, very nice, very nice. As you guys might have noticed, which way are we meant to go in? The front door? And go around the side as well. As you guys might have noticed from the last video, we are streaming now on Twitch for the Sunday night stream. So that is just for the Sunday night stream. Everything else will still be over here. Uh, Homer, how you doing? And obviously the number one priority of the channel is all about the videos and the series. Oh, we've got all the big boys here. Hello, Loza. Well, you were a bit quiet, weren't you? There we go, that's got them. Rid of them free. That noise is so annoying. One thing they haven't changed. Right, these new shells are a bit of a pain. Those are toilets. There's a lot of different designs of toilets. Oh look, we can get some brass from up here as well. Can we still knock that down? Yep. Still gain the brass that way. Are these steel or are they lead? I think these are weak. What are they going to be? Probably iron. Yeah, they're iron. Okay, well we'll scrap them down as we've got a load of brass. Not making bullets at the moment. No need to at the moment, but I can see very shortly we're going to have to. Mechanical parts. Beautiful. It's going to take me a little while to get used to these new types of shelves. Which ones we can loot, which ones we can't.
That looked like a good number. Oh, three lot pigs, okay. Fortunately, all these boxes are shut. Oh, we can loot that one. Okay. Can't loot that. Any of this? Can't loot any of that. We've got a few more toilets here. Nice thing to put in your window. And a few barbecues. Right, let's have a little look at this outside area. I do the till core. There's loads of cement here. Loads of cement and cobblestone. Ooh, I... Oh, the janitor. Here's with old Mr. Hazmat. Loads of stone here. Okay. That's quite cool. Well, we'll dig that up at the end. I've got a vending machine here unlocked. That was the area we were just in. Well, there's the loot. Well, we're not going to be able to get in there very easily. We've got the staff room back here. Any coffee? Keep the workers going. Food pile. That's not working. That's unfortunate. There we go, the electric fence post. We only got that in the last episode. Sleeping on the job, were you, Mr. Janitor? I know your trick. You were quiet. Check out the dumpsters. Be a good name for a band now, wouldn't it? The dumpsters. Well, have we got anything hi hidden in here? What were you guys protecting? Oh, look at this. Oh, look at that ammo. And a working stiff crate. Not too bad, not too bad. Okay. Well, at least that size safe. We don't get... Out of stamina. Oh, they're no more 9 mil doing things like that now. So that keeps me a bit happier. Um, while they're digging their way out of that room. Let's just have a quick little look at the old point situation. Because I've got two skill points. Um, I want to put one into heavy armour. Because I'm wearing all scrap armour. Which is counted as heavy armour. And this means we can craft better. We don't need to craft better. But it reduces the stamina penalty. So I'm going to put both of my points in there. We've already put some points into Daring Adventure. Uh, which seems to be helping quite a bit. So uh, let's check your bin. What have you been throwing away? Oh, a few jukies. He's obviously earning that much being a manager. He can afford to throw his money away. Right. Check the old roof. Oh, hello. I saw you. Haha. -ha. Knocked you out of the park. Hit him for six. Taking heads off for fun. Oh, another EK. Look at that. Now, I don't know if it's just me or you guys have noticed in your playthroughs as well. The zombie pathing. Oh, hello. Press the wrong button. The zombie pathing is terrible now rather than seeing that staircase right next to him oh he finally jumped over come on be still will you pointless Are you looking like pinocchio with my arrow in in your head yeah, rather than seeing these paths, they seem to just start beating on stuff. Anybody else up here? Nothing in there. I imagine that's where the satchel would be if you had this as a quest. Let's not fall straight down the hole. Jump onto that bit. 
We got anybody in here? No. Which is a little bit strange because there's no way out of here. So that seems very odd as there's no decent way out of here. Why they why it wouldn't be a death trap, but okay. Open everything up. Right, here we go then. What have we got? Working stiff. We're looking for a crucible. Oh! Now that ratchet is meant to be better than the wrench. So that is doing 52. That one's actually doing 54. Stamina cost 21. Stamina cost 18. So because that's a level 5, it is just a little bit better. So if we find a decent level of ratchet... That should be all right. Now, I think if I scrap that, we should... What are we going to get back? Only iron. Okay, we'll keep it for the second. That's a good start. Good, good start. Right, next one. Level 4 pickaxe. Okay. We'll check the stats. Steel tool parts. Very nice. Another one of those steel axes. Now, I had a chance with one of those the other day. Looks like a battle axe. Oh, okay. Level 5 fire axe. No doubt that is going to be better. Uh, what have we got here? Block damage 56. 59 with two mods in it. So it's definitely going to be better. Yeah, plus 7 better. That one's um, 35. So, very, very nice. Okay, and what have we got? Uh, the big box. Oh my god, look at all of this. Right, there we go. What a nice little store that was. We did that one, we did that one. I think that's everyone. Beautiful, well. That was well worth a little risk. Coming in here. So then, just saw down my inventory a little bit and look, it's literally next door. This Shamway building here, this destroyed Shamway. Now, I'm not sure if this is the only new Shamway building, but let's um, dive into here. I don't want to go up the staircase straight away. Oh, hello. I don't want to go up the staircase straight away. Ooh, backpack. Oh, look at that. Keep getting distracted. So we've got level 6, heavy armor rating 10. Heavy armor rating 10, and that's got one of these in it, so. Okay, we're going to keep hold of that. Skirt, keep hold of that. Well, we'll scrap it. Normally I'd give that to Super Fuel. What have we got going on here? Plenty of clothes. Why there's always running shoes? They're not the super running shoes, though. But they're not going to be any use to us now because we have a motorbike. Hello, janitor. I do like the janitor. He's one of the best looking new HD zombies, in my opinion. And the biker. The biker looks cool. I just wish they'd made him look more like Opie. Sons of Anarchy. That was good. Oh, I don't know why there's much going on around here. Am I missing something? Let's go up. Going around the twist. Have you ever, ever felt like this? Strange things happening. Also, can we go down? Down sounds like a bad idea. Go up. Oh. Here, flapping turkeys. They are no joke. The super water. They never used to come inside before, but now they seem to hunt you wherever you are. Trying to escape through there. That's where we came from. Go up a bit higher. More going around the twist. Right. 
Get out of here. Where are you? Oh, knocking for six. So is there a supermarket as well? I don't think I've seen this before, but I've seen some people mention something to do... Was well, that part of it? Or maybe this is the big one. I don't know, I'm getting all kinds of confused. Where are we meant to go? That's where we were. No lights in this place at all. I'm meant to go onto the roof? Check the roof out. Oh, were well, we meant to go underground? Oh, nice little blender. Did anybody ever see the blender base made in Alpha 18? Guys, check out that video. That was the first video to kind of go viral. The Kraken original. Well, no, you weren't in here last time we came in here. I don't know, guys. Am I missing? Am I missing something here? Or is this literally it? Let's go and do a quest, hey guys. I was just selling a few gubbins off camera then, and he, this guy has a bit of everything that we need. So I had to go and grab some more money. Right there we go. So shopping here. Come again. Thank you. I will come again. So we have got. Master up volume 5, degrade slower, brilliant, read that. This one here, back in the day baseball bats were the, all the rage, must be weaker zombies, it's time to upgrade, you can craft steel clubs and the contact grenades, one of the best things in the game, so be three very good useful things there for us, right we're going to sell you it sounds like we've got an airdrop i want to keep those just for the minute i'm gonna sell that and i picked up a weighted head mod because it was nice and cheap because we've now upgraded our fire axe so let's make him even stronger there we go beautiful right so it is trader restock day so we're going to pick the closest quest to us go and do that go to whichever trader is closest Looks like a conga line. So one thing I do really like about these sprites is they tell you how far things are away from you. The airdrops always used to look really big on the mini-map at the top. So it always looked like they were really close when they were actually miles away. So seeing that was only 300 metres away, to me, seemed like a good deal. So let's quickly grab that. Okay, nothing too spectacular. Right, and now we're going to go off to the quest. Um, One thing I have noticed, obviously you guys probably noticed as well, we did the video about the backpack mod. Now I'm really liking that mod. There's just one little addition though. I'm hoping that they do to it. And I would really like to be able to pin uh, some of my things up at the top. I would really, really like to be able to pin. Oh, are we going into the pawn shop? This is the pawn shop, isn't it? Yes. Um, one thing I really wish they would do to it, though, is have it, if I go into here, so just so I can show you, is be able to pin like my top five or six. I, that won't move any of those, but every time I click this, rearranges stuff i would like to i like rearranging the inventory but i'd like to be able to pin these like say five six well however many items you go out with so i would have the ammo for whatever gun i've got uh, the lock picks the hunting knife the arrows for my arrow um and maybe the wood and another tool or something like that i'd really like to be able to pin that now anyway that's enough about that we're going to quickly get the loot 
in here because the loot's really easy to get. Because it's just through this door, so we're going to get the loot once and then we're going to restart it. Uh, take a junkie. Okay, they do more damage. Let's say hello. Very. Oh, hello. Oh, come on. There always used to be a dog in here, but not anymore. Right, let's um, check everything out. Okay, not too bad, not too bad. Terrible, come on. Where's the good loot? Okay, well, seems to be doing okay with the level 2 AKs. We've got quite a few of those now. Check the old lockpicks. Bloody lockpicks. Right. Bloody lockpicks. Oh, what a complete waste of my time. Waste of my time. Right. Let's get out of here. Reset the quest. Let's do it properly. Go the right way around this now. I'm get the zombies to break their own way out of there this time. Let's put some things quickly into the bike. People are making a bloody racket up there. Beautiful. Hello. Are you the one making a racket? Taking your leg off now. Right. Let's go the right way around this. get my arrow back? No. Right. Falling down into here. You can't get back up again. Okay, okay. Is that a landmine? No, we can pick that up. Too quiet for my liking, Loza. Two more lock pigs. Cheeky little backpack. Level six helmet. We've already have one, but okay. Right, three point four meters to the White River supplies. I want to know what's in these supplies. Why are we risking our life for some supplies? I suppose we are getting dukes for it. Um, imagine it's going to be from the other side, isn't it? We'll just grab it from here so we don't forget. All right, who's wrecking the joint? Back to the gun. Not stay in a corner. Guys, you can't you can't learn it. Oh, okay. A little schematic there for us. Pipe bombs. I don't recommend using pipe bombs because they will knack her up. Uh, we don't really need any of that. We'll take the chrysanthemum. The second. They do damage your own block, so I'm not the biggest fan of them. They're not really much in this area. For us. Right, let's get this all opened up. Right, well, we actually managed to get into it this time, which is um, quite surprising. Shotgun parts, some stumper ton parts. Right, we'll sell them. Unfortunately, these are shamway boxes this time. Does mean we can make ourselves some bacon and eggs, though. Um, okay, bit of ammo. What have we got in here? Oh, that's useful. That's very unuseful. 
I will take that. Bit of food. Have you guys noticed? I meant to bring this up with you earlier. Uh, B173, which is the current version we're on. It's gone from one extreme to the other. We had bears, dire wolves, everything coming at us. There's now gone to bugger all. There is nothing left in the world. Absolutely nothing. I haven't found a deer. Apparently they've sped up the chickens and the rabbits, but I can't even see them anymore. He's literally gone from one extreme to the bloody other. Right, well, we've done this. Beautiful. Right, which crater is this taking us back to? One next to our base. Well, we've already been there and bought some stuff off him. So let's go and see the trader in this town. Right, here we go, guys. At the other trader, skull crushers. Yep, need them for Horde Knight. Uh, rock busters. Which one's this? Mining harvest. So that's for when we're mining. So let's get some of those and we'll make some fish tacos and we'll get the eye candy. I don't. I'm not using the eye candy at the moment. I think that's going to be a little bit more important when our game stage gets <laughs> out a little bit higher. What do you want? Right, let's show you some stuff. Right, have you got anything for sale? It's going to be half use to me. Cham chowder, and this stuff's meant to be amazing. Food, 53. Um, we're not doing too bad with our meat stew. Right, shotgun messiah. Bye. Urban combat. What does that one do? Landmines will not detonate. Yes, we'll definitely get that one. He does have the forget it elixir. Well, that's right, volume two. Uh, yes, we'll buy that. Make ourselves of Shotgun Messiah. Hobo stew recipe. Now that's meant to be amazing. So let's buy that. Careful out there. But always careful. Right, let's have a quick look. What have we got here? So we can use shotguns to open stuff. Okay. That actually gave us two. Did I buy... I bought two of the same one. One was in his secret stash and one was the other. And I just looked at the book icon, but because I hadn't read it yet. And that's only worth 115 to sell back. Oh, that's 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 annoying. Okay, um, landmines, yes. 5% less damage when you're wearing the jacket, okay. And the recipe. Now, how, what do we need to make that? Hobo stew. Those are rotting flesh. We've got everything else, but I believe the ratings on that are pretty damn good. We might make some of that, right? I'm going to sell him that book back. What a pain. Bracken, you need to pay a bit more attention to what you're doing. Okay, because we're quite sale, rich at the moment. Even if it's to a scumbag like you. That's just not very nice, is it? That's where we're going to have to leave this one for today. How are we doing with the books? Batter up, we should be five out of seven. And we refill all of our stamina. So we've only got two more of those to get. And I want to get as many of the shotgun messiah books. Only two, even though I bought three of them. Lucky Luda. Obviously, obviously we did have to reset. Character was reset, so that was a bit of a, a bit of a shame. Yeah, five o'clock, half five, we're going back. We're going to spend the evening, the night time, doing some mining. Very close to my next skill point. So guys, as always, big thumbs up on the video if you've enjoyed it. Make sure you join our Discord, our Twitter, and come and follow us over on Twitch as well for our Sunday night live streams. And we'll catch up with you guys in the next episode. Take it easy. Here we go, just on the way home, and I came across another airdrop, so a bit of bonus content for you super fans that wait right till the end. <sighs> well, we're not ever going to make the mini bike, so I'm going to sell that straight on. And I'm not a big fan of the rocket launcher, so but the honey is good. So, there you go. Right, that's the real ending, guys. See you later.